Hi, I'm Kate Hawthorne, Liquid Fusion Kayaking, and Jeff and I just got our Karma RGs. Doing some outfitting changes to make them a little bit more comfortable and to suit our paddling purposes. So here I am in the Karma RG, my PFD on, going to kind of see how things fit. I'm not a real tall person, about five, four and a half, and I just find this back band hits a little bit too high for my comfort. See, it kind of hits on the back of my PFD. Definitely gets in the way of my paddling, maybe even possibly rolling. So I'm going to make a few changes, make this boat work for me a little bit better. So the first thing for outfitting the Karma RG I'm going to do is take these hip pads that came with the boat and I'm going to stick them in underneath the seat, which will help to bring my hips up a little bit higher. It's also going to put me a little bit more forward in a more aggressive paddling position. Eventually I might glue those in, I might switch to a happy seat, but for now that's a fast and easy fix. So the next thing I'm going to do is reroute this back band so that it sits lower. First step to doing that is taking the ends of the bungee and getting the knots out and pulling the hooks off. I always like to put the hooks in my pocket or else they get lost. Do it to both sides. Okay, so next, we pull out the bungees. So when you're pulling the laces out, you want to make sure you leave it in this last point. It loops under here, and I could imagine that might be difficult to get threaded back through. So here we have it, still connected to the back of the boat. So now we're going to play connect the dots. We take our bungee, we're going to put it through the top one. This is point number one. Slide straight, straight across point number two. I'm going to bring him down. This is number three. Then for number four, go through the tie loop at the bottom of the seat. This is what's going to hold the back band down low. And then number five comes through the bottom of the back band. So next then, we pull our attachment out of the pocket and we're going to put it on the bungee. This keeps the bungee in place from sliding back through. You might want to put a stopper knot in this. Okay, here we go with the other side. Number one, two, three, four, five. And now our final step is just tightening things up. Pulling out some of the slack. Okay, well, let's see how it fits. A lot easier to move my torso. Rotation, 
You notice the back band's not hitting the back of my PFD. We've got nice support right here in my hips, my low back, exactly where I need it. It's been sitting in my boat. Wow, that feels great.